this is Miss Sharon and Scruffy, and welcome to Ridgeview Kids Club. Scruffy, where are we today? We are on a hike. Yes. Are you a little tired and hot? Yes. Well, what happened to us on our hike today? We got lost, right? Okay. And how did we get lost? We took the wrong path, right? We did. Yes, we got lost, but we figured it out, didn't we? And now we're back on the right path, right, Scruffy? Well, um, that what happened today reminds me of something that happens in life sometimes. Now, sometimes we're going along in our life and something happens and we have to make a decision about what we're going to do or which way we're going to go or what path we're going to take in our life, right? And it can be really hard to make that decision, okay? Well, in the, we need to know that we are not alone, okay? We do not have to make decisions like that alone, do we, Scruffy? Okay, so in the Bible, one of our favorite verses is what, Scruffy? In Proverbs 3, right? And these verses, is, they're found in Proverbs 3, verses 5 and 6, and it says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not lean on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him, and He will make our paths straight, right? Okay, so... Let's talk about that verse. How does, what does that mean and how can we apply that to our lives, Scruffy? Well, first of all, it says that we need to trust in someone. Who do we need to trust in? We need to trust in God. With what? With our whole heart, right? That's right. And we can't just depend on ourselves and say, I can do it, I don't need any help, right? We need whose help, Scruffy? We need God's help, right? Because it says, don't lean on your own understanding, okay? Instead, we're supposed to acknowledge God or turn to God for everything, right? That's what it says. How can we acknowledge God or turn to God, Scruffy? We can pray. What else? We can talk to Him and go to church, right? Those are all things that we can do. And we can, well, there's another thing that we need to do. Where is, what else do we need to do, Scruffy? Yes, we need to read our Bibles. And so if we do those things, those are all ways that we acknowledge God, okay? And when we do that, Scruffy, what will happen? What does that verse promise us? That He will make our paths straight, right? Or He will direct our paths, right? So we got lost today, okay, right? But when we are, have problems in our life and we need to make decisions, we need to remember that we are not by ourselves and we are not on our own but we need to trust in God, right? And we need to depend on who, Scruffy? We need to depend on God, right? And what do we need to, what else do we need to do? Acknowledge God in, our, in every area of our lives, right, Scruffy? And then what will he do? He will make our path straight. He will direct our path, right? That is such a great promise, and I think about that all the time. Anytime I have a big decision to make or something um, where I have to decide and make a big choice in my life, I remember that verse, and I tr do try to trust in God and turn to Him and ask Him for help. And He does. help me. Sh he helps show us the way to go, right, Scruffy? That is such an awesome verse. Now, Scruffy, what should we do today? We should pray, right? Okay, let's do that right now. Dear God, thank you so much that you promise us that in the Bible, that when we trust in you with all our hearts and, and depend on you, Lord, when we acknowledge you in all our ways, that you direct our paths and you make our paths straight. And we pray that for each one of us right now, Lord, that you help us to remember to trust in you and depend on you and acknowledge you, Lord, in every area of our life so that um, we can follow your path, Lord. So please help us to do that each and every day and help us to do the things that we need to, like praying and reading the Bible and going to church so that we can follow you, Lord. Thank you so much for your love for us and the way you never leave us, um, that you are always with us. Thank you so much for all of your blessings. In your name I pray, amen. Amen, Scruffy, right? Good job. Well, what should we do now, Scruffy? We need to finish our hike, right? Okay. Bye. We'll see you next week on Ridgeview Kids Club. Bye.